um, giving you a heads up that we're going to discuss that here in a little bit. And uh, weather flight on the flight loop? It's weather flight. And weather flight on the flight loop? Affirmative. No change to Edwards. Okay. And we have looked at that throughout the day. Affirmative. All right. Let's talk KSC. Um, first, let me get your forecast and then we'll talk from there. Broken 25,000. Broken 25,000. Visibility 7 miles. Winds 150, 7 peak to 10. And thunderstorms within 30 nautical miles. So no go forecast with the thunderstorms. Okay. Current observation also is, what's your current obs as far as, you gave me few at 12, few at 15, scattered 24, thunderstorms within 30. Thunderstorms within 30. Okay. Uh, so no-go forecast, no-go obs. Uh, aside from the anvil, I'm seeing cum development inland, and that worries me a lot. That worries me too. And it, okay. it seems like it's developing pretty quickly. And um, I also wanted to show you real quick. There's some outflow, outflow boundaries from these thunderstorms. It's right down in this area to the uh, southeast. And we're starting to follow this in. So this is some outflow that's from the thunderstorms. So I'm really concerned. I have this track through uh, 15Z. This would be where the, thund where the outflow boundary would be. And with some previous outflow boundaries, we're starting to see the queue develop pretty quick, uh, quite rapidly now. That we would see thunderstorms develop along that. And it, I mean, it, it seems like we're getting pretty close to getting some precip even, even right now. In fact, uh, we're starting to see some precip about 270 right at 20 miles. Okay. All right, Weather, thank you for that. Uh, folks, I am not comfortable with the Cape today. Uh, we tried hard. We got several strikes against the Cape. I might be able to get comfortable with the ambles, but with the inland development, uh, with the cumulus from daytime heating, and what we're seeing, I am not comfortable with that. And we're two hours from landing. Um, we're going to last. Right. We have a go to maneuver for the burn. Go to maneuver on time. Yes, go to maneuver on time. OK, we'll ask him in a minute. Fido? Go. Prop? Go. GNC? Go. Max? Go. Eagle? Go. Ecom? Go. FAO? Go. Payloads? Go. DPS? We're go. Inco? Go. Booster? Go. Surgeon? Go. How about you, PAO? I'm go flight. All right. We're in a good config for the deal over burn. Okay, copy, waiting on prop. Press good config for the burn. Good config for the burn, Capcom. Atlantis, Houston, you are in a good config for the deorbit burn. Copy, Houston, good config for the burn. Good burn, no trim required. Copy, good burn. Atlantis, good burn, no trim required. Like 2 2 is uh, really trending. Actually, it's not even trending. It's, it's been pretty solid on the last three balloons, and it really corresponds with what the uh, STA dives have shown for 2 2 nom nom. Yes, sir. And uh, good touchdown conditions, nom nom. 2,600 feet down the runway, 205 with. Uh, 205 ground speed, yes. Right. And 21 on the boards at 3K. Okay. Atlantis, Houston, we got you back a little early on an upper antenna. Welcome back, Houston. Just starting to get light where we are now. Looks good. It's 
like guidance. Guidance. As they do this first roll reversal, it's going to be uh, coming up right at a phase transition for guidance. The crew can expect a maybe a little bit larger H dot, positive H dot than they're used to. It's going to be around 50 feet per second, but it's nothing to worry about. Okay, how soon is that coming up? Flight, this is just uh, rise and search data. Uh, we should be breaking the horizon any minute here. Okay, good deal. Flight Fido, good filter shows us on energy on ground track. Nav is go and stand by for tack in. Okay. Heading down. Energy, we'll do this after hand down. Energy ground track, nav or go. Touching down Edwards 2 2, 2600. And uh, 205 with Nom Nom. Atlantis Houston, Energy Ground Track and NAB are go for Edwards 2 2, touchdown 2,600 feet at 205, Nom Nom. Houston, we copy Nom Nom, 2,600 at 205, sounds mm -hmm. great. Care data to GNC and to NAV. Take care data. Atlantis, take air data. We look at approaching the hack here. Flight, we are on energy. There is a surface wind update. New breakdown is 15 peak 21 head. Touchdown conditions will be 2900 at 205, and we still have 21 on the boards. Okay. GNC, any advisories? Flight, we got a good drag chute repo. No advisories. Max? Nominal drag chute deploy. Concur. Atlantis on energy, approaching the hack. Update to your winds. They've picked up to 1-5, peak 2-1, right down the runway. Touchdown 2900 at 205. Nominal shoot. Copy nominal shoot 2900 at 205. Gears down are locked. Copy gear. Main gear touchdown. Copy. No, it's gear touchdown. Ground speed enabled. Copy. Immediate post landing deltas. Max. No immediate. E Eagle. None. Ecom. None. GNC. None. Prop. None. DPS. None. Inco. None. Booster. None. Welcome back. We'll meet them on 5 3. Folks, let's keep a close eye on the post landing procedures. Folks, as you go through the procedures, see the crew sing out when you see those complete. checklist. 